Welcome to my YouTube channel, my YouTube video. This is my very first book haul and I'm extremely nervous, but I'm extremely happy as well. If you've been following my Tumblr, you know that I, um, what I'm currently reading is a book uh, by Kate Mitchell. I don't know how to pronounce it, um, but it's really good. So far, it's really fast paced. It's actually doing a book tour from September 19th to October 2nd. And I am very fortunate to be um, ho hosting her uh, via interview format and through a book review on two days of that uh, of that book tour. Okay, so here's the fun part. I actually went and I was intending to meet up with a friend, but she was sick. So I ended up going by myself and yeah, it was dangerous. So the first one is by Melissa Walker and it's called Unbreak My Heart. I have been looking for this book forever because I keep forgetting, I kept forgetting what the name was of the book and um, I finally just randomly found it today. It was the last copy in the store. I've been kind of jumping back and forth with this one because I saw it in the store but I'm not really used to reading this kind of adventure uh, type of book so hopefully I will like it. Um, it's called Defiance by CJ Redwell, Redwine, sorry. But um, yeah, it's very pretty. Next one, I have heard incredible things about this book. When I read the synopsis of it, I was kind of on the edge about it because I wasn't really sure if I would like it or not. Disenchantments by Nina Lacour. And I, I don't know, like I really hope I like it. It's got like a whole bunch of like different like tour pictures. Um, and this, and I don't know, it's just, and it feels really nice. Another one that I got was, um, is Wonder by RJ Palacio. Palacio, Palacio. It's, um, it's actually really neat. Like it's, it's really pretty in the sense that it's so simple, yet it says so much, you know? And I'm actually really excited to read this. Another one that I got was actually on sale. So hurrah, hurrah. Um, I got it for $4.99. Uh, and it's uh, Moonglass by Jesse Kirby. I actually saw this on um, Chapter's website and it was on sale as well there. And I almost bought it through the website but I wouldn't have gotten the, the you know, the points. And that's the main reason why I decided to get it in store. So yeah, really excited for this. About a girl, um, she was little, she used to pick up sea glass with her mom. Um, and like her, I think her mom dies, walked into the ocean and never came out. That's really sad. It's just, it looks really interesting. It looks like it could be a mystery as well. Another one that I got for $4.99, this one was kind of new to me. Um, it's called Get Well Soon by Julie Halpern. Apparently it's about a girl who's like really, really depressed. And, um, so her parents send her to an insane, into a hospital, a mental hospital. And it's very, very yellow. And this is, it's so sad to see such a happy, smiley face up, turned upside down. And this is Delirium by Lauren Oliver. Yeah. The cure for love will make me happy and safe forever. And I've always believed them until now. Not everything has changed. Now I'd rather be infected with love for the teeniest sliver of a second than live a hundred years smothered by a lot. That sounds pretty intense. And I think I've seen a trailer for this one too. Before I Fall by Lauren Oliver. And the trailer is fantastic. This book is actually Alice in Zombieland by Gina Showalter. Uh, if you keep an eye on my blog, I do Picture Mondays um, where I show my favorite book covers of 2012. And this is actually one of the book covers that I showed recently and it's really really nice like it even says off with their heads like I'm really excited to read this one um and it's the first book of the White Rabbit Chronicles sounds like something from a matrix another one that I got that I was very unsure of getting but I had heard really good things about um is Graceling by Kristen Kashore I am willing to read other types of books. The same thing gets boring very fast. So I'll be looking forward to reading this one in the future. I like creepy reads because this is gonna be a creepy read. Um, it's called 172 Hours on the Moon by Johan Harstad. The back is really trippy. 
I don't know if you guys no, you can't see it the way I see it. But it's really trippy. Like the it's and the it's very like blurry. And then it just gets more and more into focus. And it's I don't know, it just looks really it looks pretty cool. Last book that I bought today, which I have been wanting to buy for the longest time ever, and I finally bought it. Um is Sailor Moon 7. <laughs> so that's all I bought today, but I also uh, received a few other books for review um, from around the web. But these are all ebooks. I will put them up on um, a, se a separate post on my blog. Yeah, that's it. Bye. Thank you. And I'll see you next week, hopefully, with a few books. Yeah.